Imagine a machine that defies logic. No fuel, no solar panels, no wind turbines. Just pure motion. It's silent. It's relentless. In the shadows of history, one name echoes louder than all the rest. Nikola Tesla. A genius obsessed with bringing free energy to the world. They tried to silence him. But what if somewhere out there, someone finally cracked the code? What if a hidden invention was rediscovered? A device born not in a lab, but in a humble workshop. Today we reveal the Liberty Engine 2.0, an electromagnetic device that could rewrite the rules of power forever. This isn't science fiction, it's Tesla's forgotten vision coming to life. Nikola Tesla believed that energy should be as free as the air we breathe. In the early 1900s, he dreamed of a global system where electricity could flow without wires, without bills, without limits. His experiments at Wardenclyffe Tower weren't just about sending messages, they were about liberation. But the dream died quietly. Investors pulled out. Powerful interests realized what free electricity could do to their profits. Tesla was dismissed as a mad genius. His tower was torn down, and his notes were scattered as if erased from history. Some say those notes contained secret blueprints that held the key to unlimited power, buried by those who had everything to lose. Yet, whispers of his ideas never truly faded. Now, more than a century later, a small team believes they've built something in his spirit, the Liberty Engine 2.0. It isn't a wireless tower, but it shares the same goal, a free, self-sustaining power source beyond the grid. It doesn't claim to break the laws of physics, but it dares to question what's possible within them. In doing so, it peels back the curtain on a new kind of electricity, not fantasy, but grounded in precise electromagnetic motion. At first glance, it doesn't look like much. A few copper coils, a spinning rotor embedded with magnets, a sturdy frame, and some wires. But that simplicity is deliberate. The Liberty Engine 2.0 is built to perform. Once it starts, it keeps spinning. Once it spins, it keeps producing electricity. There's no fuel, no solar panels, no batteries, just motion. The secret is electromagnetic induction. The core of the engine is a rotor lined with N52 grade neodymium magnets, the strongest permanent magnets on Earth. As the rotor spins, these magnets sweep past carefully rewound coils, salvaged from microwave transformers. Each time a magnet passes a coil, Faraday's law kicks in and generates alternating current, just like a big power plant, but all here in a compact garage. The rotor itself is crafted from a custom aluminum silver alloy. Why the silver? By using this special blend, the team virtually eliminates eddy currents, tiny loops of waste energy that normally sap power and generate heat. With those losses slashed, the engine runs smoother, longer, and with higher efficiency. Every detail is engineered for perfection. Each coil is locked into a resin casing. The rotor sits perfectly centered in its bearings, Every support and slot is balanced to avoid vibration, which could disrupt the delicate energy flow. Even the startup is old school, a simple pull cord, just like an old lawnmower. No switches, no batteries, just raw kinetic energy. Once you pull the cord, the rotor accelerates to a steady 1,400 RPM. At that speed, it outputs a constant 230 volt AC, the same juice that powers homes. The Liberty Engine 2.0 claims a maximum output of 20,000 watts, enough to run computers, drills, even a water pump. And as long as the rotor keeps turning, the electricity keeps flowing. What's most shocking isn't the hardware, it's the simplicity. No hidden chambers, no exotic materials, just clever engineering and precise alignment. The Liberty Engine 2.0 is built on a brilliant feedback loop. After the initial pull start, the spinning magnets induce current in the coils. That current is fed back into the motor windings, giving it extra kick to keep the rotor spinning. In other words, the engine powers itself. Once it's running, it draws energy from its own motion to sustain its spin and continue producing output power. The genius is in eliminating nearly every loss. By using the aluminum silver rotor, they virtually remove eddy current losses that would otherwise waste power as heat. By ditching belts and gears, they avoid friction. It's a direct drive system, fewer moving parts, nothing to slow you down. Every component was chosen with one goal in mind, 
self-sufficiency. To be clear, this isn't a perpetual motion gimmick and it doesn't violate physics. It's simply an extremely efficient system that harvests magnetic momentum and clever electrical feedback to keep itself going. And yes, the team insists there are no hidden batteries. In fact, they filmed a complete teardown on camera. No cuts, no secrets. Every wire, every coil, every part was laid bare, showing that the Liberty Engine 2.0 has no hidden power sources. It's all real, all in the open. Talk is cheap, so they put the Liberty Engine to the test. In one of the first real-world trials, they set it up far from any power grid. No backup, just the engine, a camera rolling, and a lineup of power-hungry devices. A 27-inch iMac, a heavy-duty drill, a grinder, a water pump. One by one, they plugged them in. The result? The engine powered them all with ease. No flicker, no drop in voltage, only steady, uninterrupted performance. Even more impressive. Throughout the test, the output stayed at a solid 230 volts, and the rotor held its speed at 1,400 RPM. That means it was generating enough electricity to run multiple devices and keep its own momentum going. There was barely any heat, thanks to that special rotor alloy. And the noise was just a low hum, nothing like the roaring engines or whirring belts you might expect. To silence the skeptics, the team released a full teardown video. It shows every nut and bolt, confirming again. No batteries, no tricks, just plain engineering. Some will still ask how long it can run without maintenance or whether it can be scaled up for a home. Those answers aren't fully proven yet. But one thing is clear, this is more than theory. It's a working prototype delivering real, usable power. And if this is just version 2.0, the future possibilities are electrifying. Imagine a world where every home could generate its own electricity. No blackouts, no bills, no dependence on shaky power grids. Clean, silent, sustainable power on demand. In off-grid communities, disaster zones, or even space missions, something like this could be revolutionary. But innovation doesn't come easy. It needs believers. It needs support and open collaboration to get better. Stronger magnets, lighter materials, more compact designs. The team behind the Liberty Engine 2.0 is already tinkering on version 3.0, sharing ideas freely. And let's not forget the bigger picture. This isn't just about saving money. It's about freedom. Freedom from power monopolies. Freedom from fossil fuels. Freedom to imagine a future where energy is abundant and accessible to all. The question isn't whether the Liberty Engine works. It's whether we are ready to embrace a new way. What you've seen today is more than a machine. It's a message that the boundaries of science aren't fixed. They're waiting to be pushed. The Liberty Engine 2.0 is one attempt at that carrying the spirit of every inventor who ever dared to dream beyond the status quo. Whether it sparks a revolution or simply lights the fuse for the next big idea, it invites us to question, explore, and create. If free energy is possible, the future won't be built in big factories. It'll be built in garages by people who believe in the impossible. Maybe that person is you.